Can you show us how you drink? This is Rabbi Yochevet Mintz. She has Parkinson's disease, and for the last four years, she hasn't been able to carry out simple daily tasks, like holding a cup of coffee. When we got to the Rambam Hospital, and uh, the doctor mentioned that they had a new treatment for Parkinson's, I was amazed because I have Parkinson's. Parkinson's causes her hands to tremor uncontrollably, or it did until she visited Rambam Hospital in northern Israel. In this hospital, we have a new system called MRI Guided Focused Ultrasound. It helps patients that have severe tremor. Um, it basically eliminates the tremor. Before I knew it, uh, I was whisked away and there was a a, uh, an appointment made for me to check to see whether I was eligible, and I was eligible. The best part is that the procedure is completely non-invasive. Instead of going to an operating room, you go into an MRI, no incisions, no blood, nothing is inserted anywhere. We focus the ultrasound rays to a point in the brain that stops the tremor. The patient goes in with a severe tremor in one hand and comes out without the tremor. It's great. It's amazing. Is it a miracle? There you go. And crazy enough, just a day after the procedure, Rabbi Mintz is ready to face the world, or should we say the ILTV studio, as a totally new person. The past four years, for instance, I haven't been able to hold a glass of water or carefully put on my makeup or shake a person's hand without my hand shaking back. And now, now, the rabbi will most likely never have her tremors again. The focused ultrasound treatment that has changed her life was actually developed in Rambam Hospital by the Israeli medical device developer Inside Tech. Inside Tech has a long-standing collaboration with Rambam. Basically, most of our therapies were tested and trialed here before they've become commercial. This is where the magic happens, or should we say science. About 62 people have been treated here for either essential tremors or Parkinson's tremors, making Rambam the biggest site of this procedure. We have even patients coming from Arab nations that have um, no diplomatic connections um, with Israel. Tomorrow I'll be able to do works um, either uh, in the computer or at uh, homework or in gardening. Rambam has really been a major part of innovations uh, over the history. CT scans and imaging, electrophysiology for heart therapy, stenting to treat weak arteries, these are all procedures that were actually developed in Rambam Hospital. Incredible, right? One of the major items that we emphasize here for our doctor is that medicine engineering and technology and science go together. And you need physicians, scientists and engineers to create the future of medicine. This is part of what we do here. We are a startup nation. Um, in my clinic alone, we're trying to invent a walker for Parkinson's patients together with MIT that will help the patient walk when they can't. We're inventing all the time. What is happening on a daily basis here at Rambam is the very best of Israel. In the meantime, we get to see how the Israeli Medical Center is impacting patients just like Rabbi Mitz. All right, so it's been about three and a half hours since Razia entered the procedure. She's about to come out, and we're going to see how this has changed her life. And, I mean, oh, <laughs> you're fearless, girl. And look at you holding this cup the entire time, the whole time you're holding the cup. If this had been what was it, four hours ago? Mm -hmm. It's like a miracle. Men made a miracle. Or should we say a Rambam Hospital miracle?